Hi friends, my name is Alex and welcome back to the Thrifty Couponer. I'm about to run into Walmart and also a couple other stores to get a Ibotta haul here. So I did not actually get any footage in Walmart because it was really crazy in here. So let's just dive into Walgreens. This is what my basket looks like and all the paper coupons I'm using before I go to checkout. Hopefully everything goes good. I'm expecting to get a free dollar register reward and a substantial amount of Walgreens cash back and I will have a full breakdown at the very end of this video so keep watching to see all the numbers crunch down. And then I did pick up two of these 50 cent lollipops to use as filler items since I was using two different register rewards and I'm using coupons on everything else. Okay, so I'm back in the car from Walgreens. Um, everything pretty much went to plan except my uh, free dollar register reward for buying free of the crest here didn't print. All of my digital coupons came off, so um, that went much better than usual. But I somehow got $12.26 in Walgreens cash back, so I'm not sure how that happened. Um, it's going to take a little bit, but you can go into your account on the Walgreens website and you can see a breakdown. So I will look into that later and figure out where that came from. Next up is Target. I have quite a few deals to pull off here. Uh, first up, I picked up one of these Nivea lotions. This is in a travel section. It's $1.99 and we have a $2 digital coupon that hopefully we'll check out here. And then we have a really nice caress deal. If you buy free, you're going to get a $5 gift card. And there's a dollar back each on Ibotta, which makes them pretty cheap. And then I did see this buy for get a $5 gift card on the $1.99 Irish Springs. I didn't buy any. I'm pretty sure they put it in the wrong spot because I scanned these in my app. And it didn't show that gift card. But if it was true, it would be a really good deal. Then my store is still out of stock of the Bloom Razor, so I got just refills here. I got two refills. I had a 10 cent any bonus for these uh, feminine care, so I got an always liner and a 10 cent any toothbrush, so I got that Colgate toothbrush too, and the free body washes. So I should be getting $10 back in gift cards altogether at the register and then a fair amount through Ibotta back. And at the end of the video, I will have breakdowns on all of this for you. So we are over at the mirror. Here is what my cart looks like. I'm kind of stuffed to the brim here. I have five of the Klondike combs, five of the Kellogg Fruit Loop bars, two of these brownie brittles that were on clearance for 99 cents, uh, one each of these Crest toothpaste. They were both completely free, a Rise coffee, and a Kraft mac and cheese. Okay, so I just got out of Fred Meyer's. Everything actually went super well. It's been a long time since I had a couponing haul that went this smoothly. Uh, but I'm gonna get home and upload my receipts and crunch some numbers so I can give you the grand totals on everything. Okay, I am home and I have ran all of my receipts through all my rebate apps so I actually can go over numbers with you now. So starting off over at Fred Meyer, these Klondike cones are $5.99 regular price. They are part of the buy five, save five sale right now, which knocks them down to $4.99. And then we have a fetch rebate with a limit of five for $4.75 back on Klondike cones, any kind. So it made them 25 cents each. So I got the full um, set of five and I actually did try some out uh, earlier today and they're really good. So definitely pick these up. I picked up a Kraft. There is 10 cents back on a Kroger cash back, 10 cents back on Ibotta, and then there was also a 50 cent bonus for completing the Kraft offer five times. And I've done it quite a few times in previous hauls, so it made it just 40 cents for this guy. Another super easy freebie with a limit of five. These Kellogg's Fruit Loops are on the Buy Five Safe buy five, save five sale. Um, so they're a $1.49 each. We have 75 cents back each limit of five on Ibotta and 75 cents back each a limit of five on Kroger cash back. So stacking those, it makes it completely free and you can get up to five. 
Then I did pick up this guy here. This is on sale for a dollar and we have a dollar digital coupon on the Kroger app or the Fred Meyers app in my uh, situation here, which made it completely free. <clears throat> and then this is part of the buy five, save five sale. It's $6.99, so it dropped it down a dollar. There's a free dollar digital coupon and also a free dollar I bought a rebate making it completely free. And then over in the clearance section, I found these brownie brittles. I saw them a couple uh, weeks ago for $2.99. I was thinking about picking some of them up, um, but I held off and I'm glad I did. They dropped them to 99 cents each. I got two. There is a dollar back with a limit of two per day on CoinOut, and there is no limit um, beyond that two per day, so you can do it as many times as you want. Uh, so I went ahead and got those for completely free with that CoinOut rebate. And then I did pick up one of the Rise. They're on sale for $2.99 right now. There's a dollar back on Ibotta and a dollar back on Kroger Cashback, making it just $0.99. Cents. And then um, if you haven't used Kroger Cashback before, the way it works is it sends your savings. Either you can cash out to PayPal, but you do have to let a... Um, you have to hit a $20 minimum, I believe, to do that. Or you can send it to your shopper's card. And what that does is when you're checking out at the register, it will ask you if you want to apply whatever you sent over. And it will take it off like store credit. So that's how I use my um, Kroger cash back there. Then moving over to Target, let's get some any offers out of the way. I picked up this mini always liners. They were 95 cents and I had 10 cents off any feminine care. So that was one I bought an offer towards my bonus. And then I also had a 10 cents off any toothbrush. So I picked up this one for 79 cents, dropped it to 69 and got me another uh, towards my offer there. And then I was really excited to find this one. So this is in the travel section. It's the Nivea body lotion. It's $1.99. There's a $2 digital coupon that's attaching to it. And then all skincare is also 20% off. So that 20% off wasn't showing an app when I looked at this, but when I checked out, it did attach. So that knocked off a number 46 cents and you do get the full value of the coupon. So it made it a 46 cent moneymaker there. Then I went ahead and grabbed three of these Caress body washes. You can do it with any of these scents, but I picked up the Rose these are free 69 each. If you buy free, you'll get a $5 gift card. And there's also a dollar back each on Ibotta. And then I have 5% off everything mentioned from Target here with my red card. So it made it just $2.51 for the trio of them there. And then lastly at Target, I did two of these Skin to Mint Blooms. I'll definitely go ahead and do it with the razor or a razor and a refill if you want. My store has just been out of those razors forever, so I have lots of refills right now. <laughs> these are $7.99. You're going to buy two. When you buy two, you get a $5 gift card. There is a $4 digital coupon on the coupons.com app that I used, and you're also going to get free dollars each from Ibotta. If you did the razor in a refill, it would count as two Ibotta rebates towards your bonus because they're separate offers, but um, they were out of razors, so I just got two of these here. So it made it just 18 cents for the pair here. Then moving over to a very small little Walgreens selection. Uh, the reason I got these lollipops, they're 50 cents each, they're by checkout. I needed filler items to use some register rewards. You can't use a register reward on a item that already has a coupon on it. The system basically treats it as a manufacturer coupon. So, um, I had two, I had to roll from last week. So that's why these are in here. Um, we have a really good Bic scenario right now. You can do this with the ladies' Bix, the Soleil's, or any of the, most of the men's. Um, my store was just out of Soleil, so I picked up these men's. These are $6.79 each. I believe some of the women's are much cheaper than that, so definitely go with them if you can. There's a free dollar rebate on Ibotta, limited one, so we only got that back once. There is a $5 digital coupon on the Walgreens app, which is awesome. And then there is a $4 internet printable coupon you can get from coupons.com. There are also free dollar 
internet printable coupons from BIC, the manufacturer themselves on their website, but definitely use that coupons.com because it's a higher value. I believe we also got coupons recently in the inserts, but my area did not get those. These are buy one, get one half off. And when you buy two, there is $2 Walgreens cash back. And then I personally had a like a thank you digital coupon for if you spend $10 on any razors, you would get $2 Walgreens cash back too. Um, but that was something specific to my account and most of y'all probably won't have that. If you don't have that, it would be a $3.81 money maker. If you did somehow have that uh, spend 10, it would be a $5.81 money maker. Now, next up, these crests are on sale for free dollars each. If you buy free, you're gonna get a free dollar register reward. There is a $2 digital coupon that will attach to one of them. And then I use two $2 AnyCrest toothpaste uh, paper coupons from the March PNG. And those do have a limit of two, so I was able to use all of them, so it makes it basically free. Um, my, regis my register reward did not print at the store, so I'm going to have to submit a form to the Catalina website, but it's super easy. They just mail it to you. Um, so I would rather do that instead of fighting with them at the register because they really can't do anything about the Catalinas unless you get like a manager who applies store credit for you. Um, so last up for Walgreens, I don't use this brand, but um, I thought it was a pretty deal. So I went pretty good deal. So I went ahead and grabbed them. These are the Garnier Whole Blends. They are on sale for buy two for $8. You're going to get two of them. There is a $4 off of two digital coupon, and then there is also a $1 off each. Uh, it's like a Walgreens store coupon. You can either clip it to your account, or you can have them scan the little coupon book at the front of the store. And it is not a manufacturer, so it does stack on top. After that, it makes it just a dollar each for these guys. For uh, Usually there are like $4.50 each, so I thought that was pretty good, so I picked them up. And then one last thing about Walgreens, I had a uh, free dollar Walgreens cash back when you spend 15 and I guess that works even if you use register rewards. I only paid like $5 out of the pocket for all of this because I was rolling register rewards so I didn't expect to get that. And then I also have like a mystery six bucks of points that I got. I was only expecting um, two or four for the razors and free for that spend so that's five so i'm still have six of random uh, walgreens points i looked at my account at the breakdown it doesn't say where they came from i assume i had some kind of spend bonus going on um, but walgreens spend bonuses they do look at the total before coupons which is super nice so you don't have to pay cash out of pocket um, but so i had a bit of overage going on there so moving on to walmart Let's start off with a simple one. I picked up this Powerade Ultra. It's a dollar and we have 20 cents back, making it just 80 cents for this guy. And then these parcels, I'm super happy this deal came back. These are $4.94 for the 15 disc. There are $2 with a limit of five on Ibotta. And then we had two different kind of personal coupons that came out and the last uh, save, it used to be Retail Me Not, it's called Save Now, the insert. So there was a $2 off and then it showed a picture of just the discs. And then there was a separate one that was right under it in the insert that was also $2 off and it had a picture of the discs and the detergent. So there are two different coupons, but they can both be used on this guy. So I got five of them. Um, after I bought it in the coupons, it was 94 cents each, which is pretty good. That's about as cheap as these ever get. Now, there are a couple different ways you can do these degrees up. This is from two separate trips, my Shopkick reset. So I was able to do it with the Epsom salt, the body wipes, uh, the bars, and the body wash. So there are separate Ibotta rebates for basically the men's and women's versions of all of these, but there's only one coupon per kind on coupons.com. Um, so you won't be able to get two each, even though Ibotta has two each, unless you want to pay a little bit more out of pocket. Uh, but anyway, so starting off the men's body wash, 
is $5.97. And then to pair with that, I got the men's Epsom salts, which was also $5.97. You're going to get $2 back each on Ibotta. If you buy two, there is a $5.20. Oh, I'm sorry, I misspoke. So I did the body wipes and the body wash, not the men, because you have to do um, a women's and the men for the Shopkick bundle. So body wash was $5.97, body wipes was $5.97, two each from Ibotta, two each from coupons.com, and there's a 50 cent bonus on Ibotta if you do two degree offers, which made it a $1.26 moneymaker for the wash and the wipes. And then for when my Shopkick reset, I did the uh, degree maximum recovery soap, which was $4.97, and then the Epsom salts, which were $5.97. So the soap had a dollar fifty back on Ibotta, Epsom salts had two dollars on Ibotta, the soap had a dollar fifty on coupons.com and two dollars on coupons.com for the epsom salts and i already hit that i bought a bonus so i did not get that back but my shop kick did reset for 520 again so it was a 226 money maker for those guys um you cannot do all of these on the same receipt because i did do the shop kick bonus twice so just keep that in mind you could do pretty much any combination of these you could do a salt and a soap or a wipe and a soap or a wash and any of these um, you just have to have a men and a women. So you could do any of these in uh, men's or women's. I believe all of these come in the men or women packaging. Just make sure you have one each. So let's get away from the degree confusing this. <laughs> Next up, I got one of these Skintimate razors. These were $5.97. We have $2 back on Ibotta and $3 on the coupons.com app, making it just $0.97 cents for this guy. I picked up one of the good old Sunmade Bites. These are $2.44. We have $0.75 cents on Ibotta, $1.25 back on Fetch, and $0.80 cents on Shopkick, making this guy a $0.36 cent money maker. And then these Haribo Gold Bears, they are a dollar each. There's $0.50 cents back on two, so you're going to get two. And then there is a $0.10 cent any candy that attached to this. I saw some other people saying the 10 cent off any fruit snack attack too, uh, but my receipt did not pick it up and I tried scanning the barcode and it said no match. And I mean, it's not really a fruit snack, even though it has fruits on here, but anyway, so it didn't um, go through, but I made it $1.40 for both of them for two rebates, which got me pretty close to finishing off my bonuses here. Then last but not least, I got one of the Chef Boyardee's. These are 88 cents. We have 25 cents back on Ibotta, making it just 63 cents for this guy. So I had a measly $1 off a of 15 midweek moneymaker, and I finished that here. And then I also had $10 off of 20 offers for the March bonus. So after everything was said and done, this was actually a $13.60 moneymaker, which is just amazing. Um, a lot of that came from that mystery cashback on Walgreens, but even without that, it would have all been free. And most of these are paperless deals, so you don't have to have any paper coupons to pull these off. So I will have a printable uh, coupon or printable <laughs> breakdown with all of the coupons that I used and all of the apps I mentioned and all the pricing here. Um, if you have any questions about any of these deals or any of the apps I mentioned, definitely leave me a comment and I'd love to chat with you. Um, I do have walkthrough videos up of most of these apps, so if you're not familiar, definitely take a look at those before you head out to the store. Uh, but thank you so much for hanging out with me. I post big hauls like this almost every week, so if this is something you're into, definitely hit that subscribe button so you can stay up to date on stuff like this. Uh, but thanks again and have a great day. Bye!